So, Bodies the Exhibition is an exhibit where you can come and see real human specimens. We have over 160 here in Tucson, full bodies and individual specimens where you can learn about the wonders of the human body and what lies beneath the skin. So these bodies are unclaimed bodies, people who die of natural causes in China, they're Chinese citizens. Under China law, Chinese law, excuse me, they get donated to medical universities and then they can be used for education purposes or research purposes. And we have a partner there who prepares them for us, a team of amazing dissectors that gets them ready and then that's how we're able to show them around the world in our educational exhibits dehydrated out using acetone um, and then after that the bodies are positioned and they're dissected slowly and meticulously to get the view of whatever it is that you want for a specific one like this one and then um, after that the bodies are infused with a silicone polymer and so they become a synthetic you know material that's why they're you know dry and rigid but they're able to maintain their shape and maintain you know um, their form really they may come in with questions or concerns or even apprehensions. They're not sure how they're going to react when they see all of this. But once they walk through, I think they're just simply amazed by their own body. I think they're a little bit humbled by disease and what can happen when disease strikes the body. You know, they've seen examples of cancer. They've seen what it looks like to have a healthy lung compared to a smoker's cancerous lung. And so I think they walk away thinking a little more about their own lifestyle choices and maybe their own health, we're hoping. I think it's important that um, people consider bringing families, bringing kids to the exhibit. I think it's exciting for everybody. We have audio guides that are available for children as well as for adults, ages six and up is really what we recommend for that. But even younger kids come in and have questions about the body and um, are just really excited to learn here. So I don't want people to be afraid to bring in you know, families and younger individuals with questions as well. It's a good time to get them started thinking about health and disease and issues like smoking and obesity and some of these other there are things that are up and coming as a real crisis for us.